Hey guys, Mark Swift here, coming to equip with you for the internship, which I'll make you wash a bit because I'm so fucking hot today. And wearing this ain't gonna be great for that. Anyways, um, so yeah, internship. First of all, storyline for this film, uh, let me just say that it is pretty damn generic of a storyline. Okay, sure, they're going to Google and shit. But the way it plays out, it's pretty generic. It's been done before a lot of times. But for the film, it still really works really well, surprisingly well, actually. I didn't expect it to work as well as it did. I didn't expect much from this film. I thought it would just be a bit of fun, but it turned out the story was great. Well, not great, but the story actually worked a lot better than I expected it to. So, um, I mean, it even had um, a couple of scenes which were a lot like The Hangover, and the scene where that was a lot like... Um, a scene where they're basically copying a scene from Harry Potter, let me just tell you that, and um, they were fucking hilarious. So, I mean, story-wise, I'm going to give it an, uh, I'll give it a 7.5, because it was pretty damn generic, but it works so well. Um, characters, uh, Owen Wilson and um, Vince Vaughn are basically playing similar characters to what they played in Wedding Crashers, and... Um, uh, the way it plays out is kind of like Wedding Crashers. Like a lot, of, there's a lot of references to Wedding Crashers in it, but I think that was intentional, and um, therefore I give the characters a, I give them a nine because I really like their characters and um, acting. I like all these guys, all the guys that are in this. So um, acting, I give a, uh, yeah, I give that a nine as well. And um, the humour. Here's what surprised me, right, guys. I expected to go into this film and have it be very, very hit and miss. You know, just one joke, okay, that's pretty funny. Next joke, terrible. You know, but actually this film is the funniest film I've seen of this year. Yep, funnier than this is the end, funnier than all well, the other comedies, comedies that came out this year. Funnier than this is the end, funnier than Hangover, funnier than 21 and over, funnier than um, Move 43, funnier than a lot of these films so um yeah humor wise I'm gonna have to give this film a 9.5 I was surprised about how funny this film was and um overall I love this film uh I'd highly recommend watching this film and um you know given the choice over the films uh, if you want to watch one this weekend I'd actually say go for this I, you, um I'd say go for this over um now you see me and this is the end which I am not was not expected. I expected this at the end to, um, well, I expected this at the end to be really good and they let me down in that department, but I mean, I expected that, uh, I didn't expect this would be as funny as this at the end. They put it that way, and it turned out to be funnier. So, uh, yeah, highly recommended. I know it's a quick review, but I was, yeah, I'm hot. So, um, oh no, actually, one last thing I want to mention before I go. A lot of people have been complaining this film is an advert for, for Google. And, okay, it kind of is, but it's a good advert. And, um, funnily enough, um, I was watching this with my family, and when they came out of it, they didn't, their first instinct was not, ooh, I want a Google site. Their first instinct is, I want pizza. So, um, seems I promoted that instead. So, I just wanted to mention that, guys. And if you've seen the film, you know what I mean by that. But I ain't going to spoil it, but you know what I mean by they ended up promoting pizza in the end of, at the end of it all. So, um, yeah, it's Master 50, signing out.